And that's because I left it out in the rain. Yeah, bam, bam, bam. Who is your whole a pole, first and foremost? All right, let's see how much this spins today. Look at that. It barely even spins. And that's because I left it out in the rain for probably about a month or so without moving it. Uh, before I started to work and it rained and rained and rained and the piston gets moisture. The piston that's inside this and it stays compressed. So when I would press it, the gunk that's in between the piston and the wall itself is just dry. And that's why we put some penetrating grease on it yesterday to see if it loosened it up. But I'm gonna have to take it out. So let's start the job. What I'm gonna do now is try to clean off the piston. Let me turn this around so you guys can see the piston. That's the piston in there. Around it has a lot of gunk. So that's what I wanna do. I wanna clean it, I'm gonna wipe it down, and then hit it with some penetration grease. But before I do that, I'm gonna take the C-clamp right here. And I'm gonna mount this C-clamp on it. This is a C-clamp. Just gonna have it on there, because more than likely it's gonna come out when I'm pushing it with the with the brake lever. Matter of fact, I'm gonna have to take this off. Yeah, this is gonna have to come off. See, and I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna sit this, and say sit it like, oh wow. Wow, that was already out by a good, good amount. So mini me is not working. Since mini me ain't working, we're gonna try big me. Check it out. We got a gigantic C clamp, or in this case, a capital C clamp. So I'm gonna compress the piston in with this. This should work just fine. There you go. You guys can see on this side that the piston is compressing in. This is what a C clamp is for, and if you don't have a C clamp, your job becomes a nightmare. As with all mechanical jobs, the correct tools go a long way. All right. So what I was able to do there was compressing the C-clamp and see all this gunk right here? Now, before I hit it with some penetration grease, I'm gonna start wiping off the gunk because it's starting to rain right now. It's full blown pouring right about now. It's really raining. Hey, yo, the one thing people don't talk about when you talk about Philly, is the streets. The streets are so trashed and mangled. It's, it's like a war zone, bro. Like, the potholes are crazy. It's almost like they're designed that way to ruin our suspension, bro. Like, think about it. Look at this, look at this. It's craters, bro. Look at that, look at that. Look at that, bam, bam, bam. It ruins your whole, your boo joints, your suspension, tie rods. Makes everything rumble. Your bearings, wheel bearings. Horrible. The axles, man. Right? It's whack. It's the one thing that I wish that we had was like some nice streets. Is that too much to ask for? Right? Like some, some popping streets. I ain't asking for much, am I? I want some, some popping streets. And what we're gonna do is, since it's raining, I just wanna show you guys a quick tip on YouTube. I'm uploading two tours now. This tour is Philadelphia Hoods, Stanton, North Philadelphia West, part one. So at this part, this is where you add cars. I don't know if you guys watch my videos where you might see a car come up on the right hand corner that suggests something. Well, I'm able to place those cards here. If you have a YouTube account and post videos, I suggest that you add cards with interactive content. Now what does interactive content mean? You can add a suggested video or playlist that you would think that they like or should watch. You can recommend a channel, promote another channel. You can add a donation feature. You can add a poll feature, which is like a multiple choice question to get people to vote. And or you can add a link to an approved website. So what I like to do is since they give you five cards per video, I like to add a poll first and foremost so I'll say something like turn on bam see that and then I'll put 
yes my bell is turned on this is just to remind them let's see I will turn on my bell now all right I put bro yo why don't y'all check me on that the last one is notification gang I, like, sometimes I put squad but gang will work for right now create the card so the first card is dedicated to that in every video I try to do that just to remind people to subscribe and you see it has a little question box or a little uh, what's that it's not a question box that's an eye box I guess for information an eye circle an eye bubble I don't know it's an eye that's all I know right and it says turn on your notification bell and you can vote yes my bell is turned on I will turn my bell on now notification game that allows me to see the engagement on how many people are seeing my content uh, naturally versus notifications etc etc now the next thing and it also reminds them to subscribe so aside from being engaged even if they don't engage it sometimes subliminally reminds them to subscribe and click that subscribe bell next thing I like to do is I like to throw another card I like to break the cards up evenly so if the video is like this long I'll do like one two three four like maybe five at the end now you don't make any money from cards this is just a suggestion this is just you making a suggestion but the reason why this feature is good is because you can suggest other videos from your page you see look at I'm just gonna suggest my my own video oops I don't want to suggest that I was about to suggest a vlog that's Saudi right we want to suggest a tour but that's what I would do with my vlogs with my vlogs I would suggest more vlogs but for this we want to just suggest tours you see you see how I'm picking a spot and I'm just moving forward because sometimes somebody there might be the people that may watch your video for only 30 seconds or 60 seconds you at least want them to see the turn on your notification bell there might be people who may watch your video for five minutes nine minutes 14 minutes etc etc you might find somebody that'll get to minute nine or something and they're starting to get bored of the video and they're about to click out but this information bubble up top pops up and it recommends hey watch uh, North Philly Badlands after dark and that title or screen art or cover art whatever you want to call it might entice them to want to watch the video and that keeps them on your channel and helps you with the retention wow look at the bouquet that that looks awesome right all of the like the rain plus the water the rain plus the water that's the same thing you idiot stupid the rain plus the action camera you see how it looks like on the camera on the screen anyway let me add my last card so I'm gonna add another card. Uh, I'll add like this one. Oops, nope. I already added that one. I gotta add a different one. You can't promote the same one twice, so. It's helpful, it helps your channel grow. It allows the subscribers and your new viewers to stay locked onto your channel and it's just more entertaining. It's a better way to use the features that's in your creator studio. So make sure you go to your YouTube account, go to your Creator Studio on a computer, on a desktop. I believe you can access this feature from a cell phone or a tablet, but it may not be completely the same. I don't wanna vouch for it, but I do know on a computer, you can get into detail. Make sure you come back to tomorrow's vlog and see what type of stuff your boy Tooney Looney, Goony, Spoony, Roomy, Boony, Oomy, Doomy, Oh snap, I forgot I was still vlogging. Your boy Toon doing tomorrow. Really like going out of persistent mosquitoes, swatting, bam, bam. You know what I mean? Dipping and dodging. Yo, I was genuinely trying.